Hi, our friends. friends. So you guys actually suggested this video to yeah. us. Yeah. Or at least some of you did in the comments. And I have absolutely no idea why you wanted to see it, but we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it anyway. <laughs> so we have actually been out and bought some nail varnish, really cheap ones from the pound shop. Mm -hmm. And I'm excited to show you which ones that we got. You got some pretty interesting so, colors. First up. Adam's in blue and yellow, mm. so we got a blue and yellow nail varnish so to match Adam's outfit. I'm all coordinated now. <laughs> so whatever we draw, we can we could technically draw you in that outfit yeah. if we wanted to. Adam insisted we needed something sparkly. Of course. <laughs> I don't really do anything on my nails, I'm quite yeah. basic. <laughs> Same. <laughs> but yeah, we got a sparkly one. Adam picked it out, it's nice and pink. Show them the best And one. this is one that Adam also picked out, and it's one of his <laughs> favourites. And it's a frozen nail varnish, isn't and it, that so cute? it comes with a ring. <laughs> I don't know if it'll fit on my fingers. It's not going on your finger, it's going on my oh, it? <laughs> Also, disclaimer, um, I might not necessarily advise painting with nail varnish, because it sounds very smelly, and it'll probably make a terrible mess. We don't yeah. even own any nail varnish remover. No, we don't. So <laughs> if you do try, if you want to do this, make sure you either do it outside or by a window that's open, and somewhere where you don't mind getting a bit messy. And with nail varnish that you have permission to use, because some nail varnish costs like £10 yeah. to buy, which I discovered the other day, and I was and like... <gasps> <laughs> your parent or guardian would be like... <gasps> Anyway, we should get to opening these. Yay! I want to see what they're like. Well, I'm gonna open the best one first. No! No, that's mine! Do you like <gasps> She's opening it! Oh no, it's ripping Elsa's face! <laughs> that's what you get! There you go. Oh, this is so cute! I'm trying to expand this for your little sausage fingers. Hey! <laughs> eh. Do you think you'll be able to get it on? I will force it on. <laughs> I think it'll only fit on my little finger. <laughs> Even though I've stretched my fingers it fingers are a bit too wide. Oh, you're doing a way better job than me. I can never get into packaging. Whoa. This is going to be messy. Ooh. Oh, you've got the two that match your outfit done now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, I know I've drawn you quite a lot on our channel before, mm -hmm. but I really want to draw you so I can do all your blue and yellow top. Oh, my top. <laughs> yeah. Wow, look at all the glitter on that. Can you see that? Whoa. I don't know what I'd use the glitter for if I drew you, though. Okay, let me get the drawing board. Before I do though, guys, we've got a new Doodle Date sketchbook. And we've stuck our stickers on them. Steph got really angry with mine because the leaf isn't saying hi up. <laughs> I know, it's bugging me so much. I was like, be careful with those. And he's like, oh, it'll be fine, it'll be fine. So he picks up the leaf and he literally just drops it and he's like, yeah. okay, it can go there. Then I just smushed it down. I dropped it. It was an accident. <laughs> Oh dear. But they're brand new ones, guys, so we're excited to fill these up. Well, they're meant to you. be brand new, but I've opened up mine. And look at this on the first page. Let me see if you can see it. There's like some light pencil. Oh, yeah. It's like a it. cryptic potato. Which, I think it was you that did it, but I you think it. it was someone in the shop. Yeah, I think someone in the shop was like, oh, this is good paper. <laughs> Yay. One drawing board. Okay, hopefully this will make using nail varnish on a bed a bit less terrifying. Right, I'm gonna get started. I have a rough idea of what I want to do. Oh, are we gonna do like the first page in the sketchbook? Yeah, if you want you can, I brought you a uh, rubber Oh cool, I can finally get rid of this junk. <laughs> oh, the cryptic potato has gone. Cryptic potato. Yeah, it was kind of potato shaped. Are you okay? <laughs> you just scared the living daylights out of me. He sat on the drawing board and all the nail varnish came towards me. <laughs> My big butt sat on it and it went like... No! Not doing it. <laughs> no. I'm sorry, I can't control my butt. Let's just shuffle them out the way, we don't need them just yet. I'm sticking with my guns and I'm gonna draw you, even though I've drawn you quite a lot in some recent doodle dirt. You're not gonna use your brick technique, are you? No, oh. <laughs> I'm gonna use the blue and yellow nail varnish technique. Ooh, I'm so color coordinated today. I always draw you so differently every time I draw. Oh gosh, you look evil now. I'm gonna have to put you in your snowflake ring as well. I'm gonna have you holding up some nail varnishes. <laughs> I'm like an evil sales rep for cheap nail varnish. <laughs> yeah, Poundland, if you're looking for a sales rep, we found you one over here. <laughs> That's how I always stand and pose when I'm buying nail polish. Yeah. Yes, this will be perfect. <laughs> <laughs> it was great when we went to the till because I give them all to you and then I ran off to look for something. So Adam was just sat there with his hands full of nail varnish yeah. that matched and his outfit. Me, I was just like, yeah. I, love, I love how I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> this is fantastic. It this will be perfect. perfect. <laughs> so what kind of character are you doing? I'm not too sure yet. I can't fully make out where all the limbs are going just yet. You'll see. I'll try and make it a bit more clear. You'll you'll see. Okay. I hope. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm wondering whether I should ink this first or if I should ink after we've painted. Oh yeah. You've done you draw me so quickly. <laughs> I think it's because I like drawing you. I give you such little legs. Do you guys do that when you run out of page? <laughs> so you Prepare just like to lose a few feet. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> But that said, we are fairly short anyway. We're pretty little. We're pretty small people. <laughs> we're pretty much the same height, you and me. I'm taller than you. <laughs> we like having arguments about who's taller. <laughs> I'm taller than you. And every time you guys draw us like fan art and stuff, uh, Adam always has like such a victory roar every single time you draw him taller. It's huge. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to think how tall we actually are. Uh, five four ish. Yeah, maybe? something or other like that. Although you once told me you were five six, but I don't know if I believe you. I don't think I'm five six. <laughs> I think I was probably. Uh, <laughs> were you lying that day? I'm probably exaggerating. Because I told you I'm five four, and you were like, "Hmm, I'm five six. Yeah. <laughs> I must be taller than you. <laughs> what are you doing a hair now? Yeah, I'm desperately trying to catch up with you. I think I've caught on to what you're doing. It's either a lady with a paintbrush. Yeah. Or. It's a witch's broom. Nah, she got a paintbrush. That's what I'm going for. <laughs> she could be sat on like a witch's broom paintbrush. <laughs> <laughs> Watch me sit on my broom and paint. I was just thinking as well, we should do another nail varnish video one day yeah. where we buy a black nail varnish and we can use it to ink the lines. Oh yeah, wow. Yeah, that would, yeah, sure. It would probably be a to total disaster. But, but we then it would be, well, I guess we could use a pencil, but then we'd be doing everything with these. Okay, I think she's getting there now. Oh, have you give her like an undercut? Yeah. That's cool. Oh, oh, oh. Oh no, the brushes are so big. Yeah, they're quite thick. Oh, it stinks. Hey, yellow. Oh, that's, that's a nice looking yellow. It's going on a bit better than a thought it would. I remembered nail varnish being a bit tackier than this. <laughs> yeah, remember. The smell. <laughs> remember, it's smelly, so. <laughs> I might open another window in a minute. That's not a bad idea, that. <laughs> okay, let's go in with some blue. Ooh. Oh, it's so hard to, like, wipe it off the brush. <coughs> the things we do for you guys. It looks <laughs> like my shirt, though. I'm literally coughing from this. Okay, eh. let's go open another window. Makeup's gross. <laughs> I wonder how long it'll take to dry. Said on the little packet things that they're quick dry, so. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Adam's very kindly opened up some windows because this is smelly. Yeah. <laughs> this stinks. I think if we, the next time we do this, if we do it again, we'll do it outside. Oh, the yellow one stinks even more than the blue one for some reason. It's because it's made out of eggs. Even eggs smell more appealing than this. <coughs> oh, you, I think you need to take a break. I think I do. <laughs> Okay, you. I am not trusting you with that anywhere except on this drawing board, so hey, stop shaking that No, out. I wanna go. <laughs> <laughs> Let me play. Go on. Now oh, you want me to use this Oh, one? you've picked up the sparkly one. Yeah. Gee, I like this one. <laughs> you did technically pick that one, so. Mm. Oh, wow, look at this. How do people handle painting the nails? Can you get nice smelling nail varnish? <laughs> Is that a thing? Yeah, I mean this... Oh, look at that. <laughs> Smells good, doesn't it? Oh, it's nasty. <laughs> My nose has constantly got that feeling, you know, when you feel like you're gonna sneeze. Yeah, it, it gets up there. <laughs> it gets up there. <laughs> have any of you guys ever actually painted with nail varnish before? I'm quite curious now. Yeah, like, have you done this? I remember as a kid, and this is going back a long, long time to when I was like probably about three years old. I stole one of my mum's lipsticks and I drew all over the couch with it. Oh, no. And I thought I was doing something really nice for her, but she was really angry at me. <laughs> and I was really upset that she didn't like my drawings. But when I was a kid, um, I had a red chair. Yeah. And um, I carved my name into it. I was like really proud. I was like, oh, this red chair is so awesome. <laughs> and my. My mum told me off like really bad because she thought I was like doing graffiti and stuff. <laughs> Vandalism. Yeah, she was like, that's really bad. Don't you ever do that again. And I was like, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, red chair. What happened to the red chair? It went to be impounded at the police station because it had graffiti <laughs> on it. No, I don't know. Um, It's either still at mum and dad's or it's, uh, or it's long gone. <laughs> but that was my little story about being a graffiti artist. <laughs> You're on the experience. I feel like everyone, or at least creative people, have had at least one instance of doing something to like a piece of furniture when they were a kid with like paints or pens yes, or like painting it in some way. Yeah. yeah. 
Like I once coloured in all my bed sheet and any part that was white, I coloured it in with a blue felt tip pen. And when my dad came in the room and he was like, did you do this? And I pointed to my blue Ted, <laughs> cause he's blue and it was all coloured in blue and I was like, no, he did it. <laughs> Wow, I can't get this off. I'm getting a load of glitter, but I can't get this off. Yeah, the cap is so glittery on that. Oh, be very careful. If you get any of that Gosh, glittery stuff this on This is designed for, for like young ones. I can't get this off. Elsa must have really buff arms to open this up. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to build a snowman that's 60 feet high? <laughs> Look at these guns. <laughs> I'll come back to this one. I'll try the other blue. I will get that open. If we give up on it. There we go. Oh, and you can still see all your lines for it as well. Yeah, I got, I'm getting quite lucky with this, I think. <laughs> Are you adapting to the smell? Yeah. Um, the brushes as well. The brush is really similar to those ones. You know when you can get really cheap uh, watercolour sets? Oh, yeah, it is. And you get like the little red paintbrush. The brushes, the bristles are like exactly the same. <laughs> Are you going to colour a brush? Yeah, I don't know what, but I will. Well, considering Elsa's colour seems to be out of bounds. <laughs> we'll get it open one. I'll get. I, we've got some pliers. I'll use that. <laughs> You'll it. use pliers on it. Yeah. I'm gonna pop that there a second while I try and open it. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't get that to budge. <laughs> okay, muscles. <laughs> I'm gonna do it, so I'll try. <laughs> right, leave it there. I'll be yeah. back in a second. Okay. Are you actually gonna get some pliers? Yeah, we're gonna get in this thing. <laughs> so what have you got there? Oh. Heavy machinery for Elsa. Oh, careful it doesn't go all over the bed sheet. <laughs> <laughs> I had a paint tube that did that a little while ago. Okay, so if I remember rightly, it's righty tighty, lefty loosey, so. And the glitter makes it so hard to turn. Oh. No, I'm just I'm <laughs> taking the glitter off. No! I like the glitter. It does not want to open. <laughs> Come on, Elsa. You did Whoa. it upside down. We might have to call it quits on this one. <laughs> Are you so determined? <laughs> no! Elsa, no! How do you get in it? Is it just for decoration? <laughs> Is it just for decoration? It's like a Christmas ornament. Come on, Elsa! Come on! Yes! Have you done it? Yes! <gasps> I think we're actually in. Release your secrets to me, Elsa. Ooh. That's nice. <laughs> That's a nice colour. <laughs> Look at the state of that now. I had to wage war with Elsa, but we did it. Better, wage war. It better be the best blue ever. It's lilac. <laughs> the best lilac ever. I can't even see the colour. And also your colour's terrible. <laughs> wow, that is really subtle. It is very subtle. Maybe because it's intended for such young kids or something. Maybe it's because this doesn't smell either. Yeah, it doesn't stink anywhere this near. This one doesn't smell, so... I'm impressed you actually managed to get into that. Oh, I did it for Doodle Days. <laughs> I did it for you guys. Yeah, that's quite nice. I've completely ruined the handle, but... It was the power of the Elsa, yeah. right? <laughs> Channeled... You were the chosen one. <laughs> Channeled mate in an ice queen. You wanna go? Poor handle. I think it had, like, dried a bit around Yeah, the I edge. think that's what the stuff around the top yeah. was. I'm doing it as, like, a nice little lilac -y background. Oh god, you're gonna use it all up. It's Probably. a tiny little thing. I like how we've got these massive ones here and you're and like, I go for the tiniest I'll one. use the cute little heart one to fill in a background. I don't think the little brush actually goes to the bottom of this, so it's kind of hard to You have to give it a good shake. Get it out, yeah. The blue on yours mm -hmm. has actually dried denim coloured. That's good, that's kinda of what I was going for. I'm kinda of <laughs> pleased. I'm sort of confused with where to use this one, because this is the only one I haven't used yet. The glitter sure one. Not to use it. Why don't you give me glittery hair? <laughs> oh, glitter! You know it comes out in like little strand bits, mm. like uh, you see the tiny little yeah glittery details. You could do it on my legs, and they can be my hairs. <laughs> <laughs> Pink, sparkly, hairy legs. <laughs> I'm probably gonna have to do some bits in the pencil ink brush just to colour your hair, because we don't have like a dark color. a dark color. But yeah, I got that's why I got kind of lucky with the hair on. Uh... Yeah, yours is really lucky. You've not had to like colour anything in the pencil, really. I kind of wanted to avoid doing that. I can't... Hey! <laughs> Should have told me that before I picked a subject where I couldn't do that. <laughs> <laughs> look at the look at the aftermath of this, guys. I don't think anyone could have opened this thing. We were just saying how lucky we are that we did this inside the house, because we thought it was a stupid idea to do it inside the house. Yeah, we'd be outside and I'd be like, I forgot to carry my pliers. <laughs> yeah, who brings tools around <laughs> with them? I need to make sure this stuff dries so that I can put like my hand over it to do the... Oh, thing. yeah. That's why. Wow, it dries pretty fast, so it's just kind of a bit tacky. Oh, cool. 
Are you gonna try and ink some now? Might as well. Ooh. But yeah, we totally need to do another nail varnish video one day and bulk up our colour collection. Yeah, sure. It's so hard doing it, trying to not put my hand <laughs> in that sticky stuff. I'm definitely having one of those days where I feel like I'm not being a good example to children. <laughs> <laughs> so you want to do the nail polish challenge? Well, first of all, you need to get a really big set of pliers. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Might not advise that one, kids. <laughs> I'm still wearing this, by the way. <laughs> I've drawn you in it on this as well. Have you? Mm -hmm. Got my bling ring going on. Yeah. Oh yeah, there it is. Oh, this is hard. My hand's like drying into the <laughs> nail varnish as I'm doing it. Oh no, you open up the smelly one again. Yeah. Because I wanted to do like, uh, like as if there's like drops all over the floor. Oh, like paint splatters. <clears throat> yeah. I tried doing Aww. this, but it's a bit too thick. Yeah, you can do that with like watercolour yeah. and stuff. How do people work in like nail salons and stuff? Yeah. They must stink of this like all day. You guys must be like surrounded by it all day. <laughs> I've never had so much like respect for people who work in nail salons. <laughs> Beauticians of the world, we salute you. Yay, she's covered in paint. What are you doing? So your shots are going in. Oh, that's good. It's separating your mm -hmm. hair from your head now. Kind of all merged into one thing Yay. before. I want to use the blue to try to do a tiny, tiny oh, little snowflake ring. pattern on it, but... Oh no, this brush is like the size of the ring. That's it, just try and wipe some off, and then just a little boop. Boop. There we go. <laughs> Perfect. Close enough. <laughs> It's funny because like Frozen's known for its really intricate yeah. snowflake designs and mine's just like <laughs> And then where's that sparkly pink? You're going in with some sparklies. Mm -hmm. Wow, that is sparkly. I love the sparkly one. It oh. might show up better on the uh, darkness. Oh yeah. Can you see it? You need to get some pink highlights <laughs> in your hair, I'd be feeling it. Oh, I'm booking in. Oh wow, well, let's put it on your shots too. <laughs> Why Come on, get <laughs> Oh, I wish I had a pair of shorts that look like this. I'll find you <laughs> some. <laughs> Put some on your legs as well. Yeah, don't forget my gorgeous glittery legs. It does actually look like hair on That's the what legs. I said, yeah. yeah. Look at those hairy legs. Granted, one's a bit more hairier than the <laughs> other one now. Are you dabbing at that to get some of it up? Yeah, I put, I put way too much yellow on the first. <laughs> I was like, what have I done? You know, I just remembered when we were buying this nail varnish, we went in with like five pounds and it was in a pound shop. Mm -hmm. And uh, we could have actually got one extra nail varnish, but I was insistent that I wanted breadsticks. You wanted my breadstick? <laughs> so we could have had one extra colour in this challenge and you never know, it could have been the colour I needed for like Adam's hair and shorts. But no, breadsticks. <laughs> If you haven't seen our painting with coffee video, we'll link that above. Yeah, that was an experience. And we'll see you again next week for another doodle date. Tiny evil bottle of nail varnish.